This morning, abortion rights in America are back in the spotlight. On the federal level, the fate of a key abortion pill is now once again in court. Oral arguments are set to begin very soon before the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals, a case brought by anti-abortion activists who want to ban mifepristone nationwide. And then on the state level, the focus is in the Carolinas, where two separate efforts to further restrict abortions in both states have hit a critical juncture. In North Carolina, nearly all abortions after 12 weeks of pregnancy are now banned, as the Republican supermajority in the state legislature voted to override Democratic Governor Roy Cooper's veto of their bill. Shouts of shame could be heard from the gallery after the gavel fell there. And in South Carolina, Republican lawmakers are at it again after debating for more than 12 hours yesterday on a near total ban on abortion. They're heading back into session to continue the fight. Let's start in North Carolina. CNN's Diane Gallagher is in Raleigh, North Carolina for us. Diane, after having his veto overridden, what is the governor going to do? Can he do anything? You know, Kate, from a legislative point, no.